Welcome back YouTube, I have Ahmed again from In-Depth Tech Reviews and here we go again, another comparison between Google Assistant and Siri but this time I have the new Siri that came with iOS 14 on my iPhone 11 Pro Max and the new Google Assistant we saw last year that came with the Pixel 4 XL and we're gonna put both of them neck to neck to see which one is better. And the reason for this comparison because Siri got some major changes with iOS 14. And the first change is the new compact UI we saw in the new Google Assistant last year and it also can understand more what's on the screen and help you ask follow-up questions and also it can now send voice messages and more complicated questions. So I'm gonna put it neck to neck with the new Google Assistant to see which one is doing better. So let's see how each assistant will perform, but before getting started, let's make sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon to get notified every time I post a new video. So let's jump in. Before starting the test, let me explain how I will do it. I will classify it into three different categories. Category number one is to show you which one is better in understanding what's on the screen. The second category to show you which one is smarter by asking some complicated questions. And the final category is to show you which one is more interactive so you can get the information you need without looking at your screen. Please note that both devices are using beta softwares. Here I have iOS 14 beta and here I have Android 11 beta. And I'm setting my Google Assistant to the full speech output to make sure it's as interactive as possible. So now let's start with the first category and see which one understands what's on the screen better. Send it to Ahmed Nagy on WhatsApp. Send it to Ahmed Nagy on WhatsApp. I'll need to access your WhatsApp data to do this. Is that okay? Yes. Which one? The first one. What do you want to say? Cancel. No problem. I won't. Reply, how are you today? Reply, how are you today? Here's your reply. Ready to send it? Yes. Okay, it's sent. Read this article. Got it. From indepthtechreviews.com, Android 11 Beta 1 official release. Media can. Read this article. Hmm, there's nothing to read. Show me the weather. Currently in Dubai, it's 32 degrees and clear. Monday, it'll be sunny with a high of 41 and a low of 29. Due to the current humidity, it feels like it's 41. What about tomorrow? In Dubai, Monday, it'll be sunny with a high of 41 and a low of 29. Show me the weather. It's currently clear and 31 degrees. What about tomorrow? It should be hot and sunny tomorrow with a high of 42 degrees. Show me the actors of Godfather movie. The cast of The Godfather includes Al Pacino, James Caan, and 25 others. What is the year of production? Here is information from Wikipedia. Who is the director of the movie? The Godfather was directed by Francis Ford Coppola. Show me the actors of Godfather movie. Here's what I found. 
What is the year of production? Here's what I found. In this category, Google Assistant understood what's on the screen six times while Siri scored only two. Because it wasn't able to send the photo showing on the screen. And finally, it didn't help at all when I asked about the Godfather movie. So now let's move on to the next category. And here I'm going to test which assistant is smarter. Send the voice message. Sorry, I can't send audio messages yet. Send the voice message. Who do you want to send it to? Test account. Okay, recording. Hi, how are you today? Great. Send it to test account. Hi, how are you today? Send it. Okay, it's sent. Help me sleep. Help me relax. Help me sleep. Have you tried counting electric sheep? Help me relax. I'm quite relaxed. Very, very relaxed. Show me last week emails from Google. Show me last week emails from Google. You have six email messages from Google since last Wednesday. Last Saturday, Google sent you an email about Omar installed Super Slime Ben. Do you want to hear the next one? No. Record the meeting. Record the meeting. You have nine upcoming meetings. Record a voice memo. Record. I'm not sure I understand. Share my location. Who do you want to share this with? Ahmed Nagy. Ahmed Nagy. I have your location as Remrom, Dubai, United Air. Share my location. Sorry, I wasn't able to share that for you. Translate, how are you today in Spanish? In Spanish, that's... ¿Cómo estás hoy? Translate, how are you today in Spanish? In Spanish, how are you today is, ¿Cómo estás hoy? Remember my dad's date of birth. I found multiple matching contacts, including father and Papa Jones. Which one do you want? The first one. Sure, when's the birthday? 5th of September. Okay, I'll remember that father's birthday is on September 5th. When is my father's birthday? September 5th. Remind me to buy a gift one day before my father's birthday. Okay, buy a gift. This will be for September 4th. At what time? 12 p.m. All right, I'll remind you on September 4th at noon. Remember my dad's date of birth. I don't 
know when it is. 5th of September. Here's your appointment. Read my notifications. You've got new messages from Ahmad Mohammed and very high partying face two messages. The first one is from Ahmad Mohammed on WhatsApp. This is a test message. Do you want to reply? Next one. Next, conversation in very high partying face two messages on WhatsApp. Ahmed Nagy said, Fakreen ESM El Hotel Ili Khan 3ML Offer dot con Esmo A. And, tears of joy. Wanna reply? No. Read my Facebook notifications. There aren't any new messages. Read my notifications. You have notifications from WhatsApp, YP Studio Tips, Instagram, and three more apps. First, from WhatsApp. Emma Hasim, this is a test message. Do you want to hear your YT Studio notifications? Next one. Marvin Vallejos commented, We'd both say read me as do. Callum K. Gittins commented, This is a great, honest review. I'm gonna wait for. Srilikid replied, In depth tech reviews, okay, I will try, thanks for the. Ritwick's Magical Paradise replied, Yes. Read my YT Studio notifications. 10 notifications from YT Studio. Marvin Vallejo's comment. In this category, Google Assistant scored 9 while Siri scored only 5. And that's because Google Assistant was really smart when it comes to setting reminders, reading articles, and recording meetings. However, it only left behind when it comes to sending a voice message like Siri. And when it comes to reading notifications, Google Assistant can only read messages and nothing else. While Siri can read all notifications including messages, and I was able to ask about notifications from a specific app. But overall, the win goes to the Google Assistant one more time. Now let's move on to the final category, and here I will test which assistant is more interactive. In this category, I'm not going to ask new questions, but I will point to the previous commands. For example, when I asked it about last week and the unread emails from Google, Siri managed to read these emails for me, and also ask it if I want to read the next one. So let's check it again. Show me last week emails from Google. Show me last week emails from Google. You have six email messages from Google since last Wednesday. Last Saturday, Google sent you an email about Omar installed Super Slime Ben. Do you want to hear the next one? No. And I do like this kind of interaction from Siri more than Google Assistant. Because it makes your life easier if you are not able to look at your phone while driving, for example. And the same behavior applies to reading notifications too. As it gave me a summary of my notifications before starting to read them. So in this category, Siri is better. So that's pretty much it. That was my comparison between Google Assistant and the all new Siri from iOS 14. Please let me know in the comments what do you think. So I hope you like my video and if you do, please hit the thumbs up and subscribe for more videos. Thank you for watching.